Oh, well, it's time for a new video. I'm back. I don't feel like I made a video in over a week. Uh, but we're going to look at some current cheap rat toys that you can get right now on eBay. Well, let's take a look. Welcome back, guys. This is me, Junk Man here. We're going to look at what's currently on eBay right now, some rat toys. These are usually toys you find on a... <laughs> Toys you find on a spinning rack and maybe a drugstore, maybe like CVS in the 70s and 80s. I guess they have CVS. Refco, maybe. Family Dollar, I guess, was around back then. Roses, if you lived in the South. Um, <coughs> and I'll try not to cough. I've just, I went out of town last week for work, came back. I don't know, I've just been feeling bad all weekend, but I wanted to get this up because I hadn't done a video so long. So I'll try to edit out any coughing I do, so sorry about that. But let's just head over to eBay. And remember, I'm not selling these on eBay or anything. This is a sponsorship, but you can go on eBay and get these right now. So let's take a look. And we're gonna start right here with Rambo. Yeah, our R-rated movie. Doesn't mean they didn't make rat toys for kids. And here you come, you got your survival knife. Gotta have that if you're Rambo. Uh, Rambo's riding a horse, I don't, I don't really know why. I don't think you ever, maybe Rambo 3D ride a horse in it. I, I don't know. Survivor Kid comes with a watch. Um, looks like some kind of string. It should come with a compass. I don't know why it doesn't. It's odd. A compass is really big for rat toys. And then look at this. 1974 Superman, Batman, Robin. I think I see a Clark Kent. Rat toys. Look like bendy rat toys right here. Look really cheaply made, that's for sure. They don't look like anything really fun. How about this right here? Just a dude riding a bicycle. He's laying on it. I used to have a friend. I used to have a friend named Willie that used to sit on a bike like that. He'd go down the hill by the house. It was a big steep hill. And he would do that. He would lay on it like that. And Nobody was really impressed. I think he did it to try to get the girls impressed or maybe the guys. But nobody, nobody was really impressed with it, to be honest with you. How about this right here? The Simpsons. Yeah, here's one for the 90s. What's that say? KB Toys, $1.79. I miss KB and toy prices that low. Uh, you got a watch. Look like you got some kind of ring. You got a Simpsons ID card. I don't know who would buy the Marge one. I can <coughs> I can understand a Bart one, a Homer one. Who's buying the Marge one? I guess they had them all. And I don't know, I guess maybe that's a wallet or something. Time and money. Born to shop. Sounds like a woman. Can you stop a woman from shopping? How about this one? Yeah, I know when I watched a William Shackner TV show in the 90s called Rescue 911, the first thing I wanted to do is run out to the toy store and buy toys related to it. Rescue 911, as seen on TV. Got your axe, got your bullhorn, uh, got a bunch of stuff right there. See, a first aid kit, a lot of stuff. But none of this stuff's gonna help you. If your dad, if you get a little kid and you get this and your dad has a heart attack and falls down the stairs and cracks his head open, don't get any of this stuff. It ain't gonna do shit. How about the A-Team? <laughs> yeah. Ball gun. Look at this. Rocket ball gun. I used to love these rocket ball guns. I had a few of them. Never had the A-Team one. Never had an A-Team one. But I had some of them, and they were really fun. How about this right here? Now this. Strange. Pipe keychains. What kid... Wants a keychain of an old pipe. I don't understand this one. I don't. It says it's from the 1940s, so maybe that's just seems really. I mean, it's not even a corn cob pipe. I can understand that. Kids love a good corn cob pipe. Makes you look cool, but I don't understand this one here. How about friends? I think this was a nine. I think I did a whole video on these. <laughs> I don't know if I can really count these as rack toys. Well, they were kind of like a Viewmaster thing you look through and it's kind of like finding Waldo, but it was Marvel related. Yeah, I think I did a whole video on these. But there you go right there. Find them, Spider-Man. How about this one? Scooby-Doo goes boating and you don't even get a Scooby-Doo toy. They just put Scooby-Doo on the package, but you don't even get... They, they could at least got a little figure right there that looks like a little boy. Got a little boat to put him in that says Scooby-Doo on it. A little car that says Scooby-Doo on it. But it's not even. It's not even shaggy. It has nothing to do with Scooby-Doo. What a rip-off. And how about Superman, a little zip bug? I know when I think Spider-Man, I think of a little zip bug car. All right? I hadn't seen that in any of the movies. That would be cool. Why don't Spider-Man have a car in the movies? Spider-Man's got to get around. He's not always in the city. He can't always swing around. He needs a car. How about this? 
Uh, Captain America, handcuffs. Uh, Spider-Man watch. Captain America, oh, it's Spider-Man and Captain America, I guess. Uh, Walkie-talkie, a little bag to put everything in. Some plastic handcuffs that's going to break. Hmm. And uh, the watch right there. Uh, that's just... That looks like some crap, and they just stick some marble logos on it. How about this right here? Hunter, remember that television show? Can you believe they made stuff on Hunter? But there we go. Hunter. TV Super Cop. Now, I've watched Hunter before. I, I wasn't a huge fan. Didn't hate it. Just Maybe it came on with something else on. It came on Friday or Saturday night or something, so I didn't really watch it. I knew I've seen some episodes. But I wouldn't call him a Super Cop. It wasn't like Robocop or anything. Could, I could be wrong. Maybe there was, maybe there was some... You know, maybe it's the later season when they try to get more people to watch. Maybe he fell in a bad acid and make him super cop. I'm not sure. But here he is with a little red gun. That's not super cop. Got some plastic handcuffs. At least they're the right color. Got a little badge. And, of course, a cheap plastic walkie-talkie that doesn't do anything. And then you got a Batman. Yeah, when you think Batman, you think Batman gun. I know I do. There's Batman gun with some little targets to shoot down. Um, what's this? What shoots? It's this pop gun. I don't see, oh, okay, it's got some little black pellet thing that shoots out. I was going to say, I didn't see the bullets. But there you go, Batman. How about Ninja Turtles? Ninja Turtles even have rat toys. This is some kind of pinball machine. <coughs> there we go, from the 1992 Ninja Turtle pinball, pinball, I like pinball. How about Flash Gordon movies? What an odd name. 1981, I guess they were trying to capitalize on Flash Gordon. It doesn't look like anything of the 80s Flash Gordon. I can't even tell exactly what this is. Flash Gordon Movie Viewer. I, I think this is, comes with like some film strip you put in the back of it. And it was like old Flash Gordon. Like, you know, way long time ago. For you and before I was born. I'm talking about when your dad was little. Um, how about a Dungeons and Dragons? Oh, sorry. Dungeons and Daggers. <laughs> trying, trying to be Dungeons and Dragons. I didn't want to get sued. A uh, slide puzzle. Although it doesn't look like it's missing one of the pieces. Is this toy? Uh, I used to hate those slide puzzles. Good slide. I could never get it back together. God, I hate those slide puzzles. And then you got another 18 toy. Look here. 18 toy, toy chopper and launch pad. This is like a little spinning wheel. It shoots off like a helicopter, but I don't think it has the base. It just has the round part. They were kind of cool. I didn't have the 18 one of this either, but I had some of them. Wrist one. I never had one that goes on your wrist. That would have been really cool. I, I would have got the ladies for sure. Oh, I would have been in the third grade getting panties wet that they didn't even know they could get wet. That's not pee, girls. That's me with an 18, uh, what, 18 chopper pad. Then we got the Captain America Shooter Gallery. Yeah, when I think Super, when I think Captain America, I think of shooting ducks. A little pink duck and a little red duck. And the dart gun. At least it's plastic. I like the plastic dart gun. They kind of made them rubber later and well, it wasn't fun at all. How about the bong? A Batman parachute. Everybody had these. If it wasn't Batman, if it wasn't Superman or something, you just throw it up. It has an army man. I think everybody had these. Um, it was always good. My grandma had like a little balcony in her living room. I could drop them off there, and it was a lot of fun. Take them outside, I usually get stuck in a tree or a roof or something. They wouldn't last too long, but they were fun. Then you got a Wild West shootout. Comes with two bull two cowboys and a backdrop. This looks like it might be boring, gets crap. I don't like toys that are designed just to sit there. Ooh, boring. And then you got Crime Fighter set. Another Batman set right here. You got some, I thought they were sunglasses, but they're not. They're, uh, they're handcuffs. You got another cheap plastic walkie-talkie and a watch. And it looks like a little bag to hook to your belt to put it on there. How about Biker, Biker Mice from Mars? Remember that in the 90s? You can't, you 90 kids know that for sure. It comes with a throwing star. That's not really a throwing star. It's just got rubber darts on it. It's probably never going to stick. And some badass sunglasses. I haven't done a bully beatdown list in a long time. If you wore them sunglasses, even if you wore it to church, you're going to get punched by the deacon. I don't even know what a deacon is. I just think I heard that before. It goes to church. How about a Spider-Man magnifying glass? Oh, right. You want to look at those ants? No, you don't. You want to burn them. You can use the Spider-Man magnifying glass three times. Three times. It enlarges it. You can get it right now on eBay for $29. 
How about a beehive? What? 1985. 1985 beehive maze. I always liked mazes as a kid, so this might have been fun. I've never seen this before. To win, settle each bee in its in its place. Oh, oh you got little balls you got to put them. Sounds like one of these you take in the car on the road trip and your dad would hit potholes and have to start all over. Oh, didn't look too fun. How about the Archies? Yeah. Remember Archies? A dang, what? Keychain? The new Archies money set. It says money set, but it looks like a keychain. Open. I don't. It comes with some fake money, but what's with the keys? And Jughead holding them like this. I don't. 1985 Jaw Rule, the new Archie's money set rat toy. Never opened. I guess if you got money, you gotta have a car, so you got a bunch of keys. And I don't know why it says money. Hey, it's keys, right? That's not. Yeah, that's keys. I don't know. Let's move on. How about Battlestar Galactica? You got your wallet. You can show people. Hey, look, I'm a member of the Battlestar Galactica. Right there, fill it out, put your name on it, put your hair color, put your eyes color, put your age. Right there, everything you need to know in case you drop it, and a, a guy in a van wants to wants to get you because you'll, you'll drop this, and about six days later he said, "Hey, ain't you Steve?" And he'll have your address and everything. Your mama told me to come pick you up and get in the van. But hey, this was a different time. If a guy tried to get me in the van by telling me he had Star Wars toys. I take a finger in the butt for some free Star Wars toys, maybe more than a finger. How about this right here? Super Gorilla. Probably came out around the 70s when uh, King Kong came back. Oh, look at his legs. His legs look broke. This is like the King Kong after he fell off the Empire State Building or the World Trade Center, depending on what King Kong you watched. Whew, what a crazy looking King Kong. And we got a karate original headband. Not to be confused, it's the original headband. Uh, I guess if you're really into King, and if you're really into Karate Kid, this would be kind of cool. You put it on your head and run around and kick stuff. Not got much to say about it. I wouldn't have bought it, but I can see, I can see where it'd been fun for kids really into that. And how about this? Foo you, foo you. Reese is just saying it. Oh, make mysterious. Some kind of game, but it just. Looks like something they would say racist today. I don't know. I can't keep up with what is PC and not PC and everything, but I just got a feeling that uh, I can see people getting upset about this one because people get upset about everything. Oh, that agent's got yellow skin. I'm upset. Oh, and how about this? I've talked about this before. I have to bring this because this is, I just love this one. 007 sunglasses. But this is probably one of the best packages I've ever seen for a toy. I mean, you want to be a secret agent? Walk around with your oversized plastic sunglasses that say 007 on it. It's got a gun on it. Oh, that is, that's some great packaging right there. It's got Roger Moore with his glasses on his face. I, I just love that one. I just love that one right there. I, I might have to buy that one on eBay. Because all that stuff is currently on eBay right now. Good or bad, I'll let you decide. Decide. Well, I'm going to go rest my voice. I'm already talking too much. It's hurting. Be back tonight at 8 o'clock with another, another video. And... I got my bottle of skeet. Gonna go get a slaw burger. Hey, jump man <laughs> channel popping though. Thank you, sir, for that unsolicited testimony. <laughs> <laughs>